The severe storms that struck the island Friday and Saturday have led to severe flooding, with rivers of water overflowing into the roads and the closing of the Iraklian airport. The last time Crete was caught this badly was in 2019, when massive landslides were the result of intense rainfall. The floods have taken the island by surprise, washing cars out to sea and residents scurrying for protection. The floods hit the northeast coast of the island earlier today, bringing a deluge rain to Aja Pelagia, a village in the region of Heraklion, part of Malavisio municipality around 25 kilometers west of Heraklio. Rapid change in weather hit the coastal city, as well as the neighboring town of Ligaria. Houses in Chania, on the western side of the island, were also hit. Locals from Lasithi received SMS warnings not to leave their homes. Several roads in the city are flooded, and Heraklion International Airport has been closed due to its runways being underwater. Hundreds of calls for help during the floods were made to the police and fire brigade in Crete, and the Coast Guard has now joined the search. Several cars have been completely swept away. As for the Heraklio Airport, no one evidently know when flights can resume, according to the manager. The rains causing the flash floods have now stopped, but the island has been heavily damaged. Debris lines the beaches and many houses are now uninhabitable due to the flooding. The search for the storm victims is also still not over. Severe weather conditions saved today, Sunday 16 October, on Crete and Dodecanese where torrential rains are expected in places in the morning rains and strong storms.